Do you know that almost a quarter of all global deaths and disease occur due to environmental risk factors? These include air pollution and climate change, dangerous chemicals and radiation, unsafe infrastructure, lack of clean water and sanitation, and other hazardous environmental factors. All these hazards influence the length and quality of our lives, with children and those in low- and middle-income countries most at risk. Tackling these hazards effectively could save millions of lives every year. If you're a national or local leader involved in planning and strategy, working directly in healthcare, or with environmental issues, there are tools and resources to help you play your part. We have developed the Compendium of Guidance on Environment and Health, which lists comprehensive actions and policies to build a healthier environment for healthier people. These actions can help to clean up our air, improve our food, manage chemicals and solid waste, provide clean water and sanitation services, protect people from radiation and climate change, and create safe and healthy environments in cities, housing, workplaces, and healthcare facilities. The compendium points to practical guidance on how you can help to increase the use of renewable clean power sources to reduce indoor and outdoor air pollution, which contributes to 7 million global deaths annually. Mitigate and adapt to the effects of climate change, which can save 250,000 lives every year. Provide access to reliable and modern energy in healthcare facilities. Promote better waste segregation, recycling, reuse and processing. Improve access to safe water services for a third of the world's population, which can prevent over 800,000 deaths each year. Improve safe and sustainable transport and mobility systems to contribute to help avoid 1.3 million deaths annually occurring from road traffic accidents. Together, we can create a greener and more sustainable future for all. Why wait? Let's start now.